Uh, speaking of queens, um, <laughs> have you heard about the Biden's new White House monkeypox coordinator, Dimitri Daskal- Daskalakis? Is his name? No. Yes, we have a White no, House. I want you to try and say that name a few more times. What? <laughs> Dimitri Daskalakis. Um, oh, okay. Now, okay, brace yourself. This is a, okay. a picture of the new monkeypox co- coordinator for the White House. Now, I don't care if you're gay. I don't care if you have gay fetish bondage lifestyle, whatever. <laughs> but if you wanted to destigmatize a disease that you don't want people to be talking to be relating to gayness, was there nobody else? Was there nobody who doesn't have pictures like this floating around on the internet for the butt sex disease? It just it's- like this is, is on you at this too? point yeah it's also a yeah his bondage is also a pentagram i was wondering if you'd catch that um nothing to see I here would. yep um yeah wow they keep saying it, like they keep saying oh it's just men who have sex with men it's not even gay men it's just men who have sex with men which is a different thing <laughs> And this is not related to gayness we were, at all. We this is not a gay disease. It. And this is the guy that you chose to make people think that this is not. I mean, come I, on. Like, it, this has to be intentional, right? Like they must be just like, it, it's like everything we see now. It, it feels like a, I have to admit, a clever script writer who's intentionally parroting. Like I'm half convinced that we have like a like a libertarian conspiracy infiltrator who's like <laughs> writing the scripts stuff? for the plan. That's for the after party, like, man. <laughs> I was gonna say maybe oh, shit. Maybe I am. Damn. Uh, <laughs> maybe I am. Uh, yeah. Almost like like how could you write anything more openly satirical of of themselves than than what they do? You know? Nasty pig I, hero is his uh, I believe dancer name at the gay bars. Nasty wait, pig hero. Wait, I thought hero. that was. Um, John McCain's nickname. I thought that's what. Um... I thought it was Megan McCain's oh, okay. nickname. <laughs> so it's the... right. Yeah. No. I thought. Okay. Oh, she inherits it then. Okay. That's right. what that was. Okay. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. Again, I don't care about your lifestyle, dude. I, I like as you don't have to be a, be like a PR rep or anything to see. I like. I don't know what your goal is. You knew that this would come out. It's like yeah. they intended for this type of thing. Like they knew, they knew that this was going to happen. They knew that people would immediately find these pictures of him, like I, I guess doing like gay strip shows and stuff like that. Um, but they keep trying to destigmatize this thing and make it not about gayness. I just, what are, what is the the end game here? Like I can only put on my conspiratorial hat in this one. No logical thinking person yeah. would be like, seems like the best option. To destigmatize this thing, right? Get yeah, the bondage guy think, out there, right? Yeah, you think of their goal, the guy who clearly, obviously, has monkeypox right now. <laughs> We're gonna get him out there to be the representative re- representative face for this. It's the same way that they keep trying to tell us that space isn't fake and gay, but then you know they're talking about how many gay spacemen they want to send to space now, and so <laughs> or space women, and, right? And you know, send Little Mermaid. You know, she. There's a connection there between Little Mermaid and space, I'm sure. Uh, I, I think there's something there, yes. Um, that Little underwater. Mermaid thing. Both are underwater. <laughs> that's underwater what I was so say. That's, yeah, that's how that's they filmed say. <laughs> They were both definitely filmed underwater. Um, and they pretend like they weren't. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah not, nothing to see there with uh, well, Mr. I'm going to write this down for the next book. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, when, uh, when the Queen died, I'm sure you saw my tweet. Uh, it was like, this is Jack. It was like the meme of the kid, like scribbling. It's like this Jack Casey oh, yeah. <laughs> realizing that his book comes out in two days and the queen just died. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, it's seriously, honestly, like that's half of what took me so long to write the next one. Cause like I'd be building out plot lines and character jokes and all this stuff. And then just more funny, absurd shit would happen month yep. by month. And I'd be like, God, I got to work that in somehow. You that's know, how like, I feel like here to put it there. That's how I feel trying yeah. to do this show every week. I'm like, all right, here's what we're talking about. We've got a full lineup. And then it's like, oh, God, Biden is speaking again. Ah, now I got to work <laughs> that <now>? in. <laughs> yeah. 
Well, I know. And then it, with perfect timing, right? Like a week before I, I dropped, you know, uh, WBW2 on, uh, on, on, uh, you know, 9-11, um, this holiday season, uh, <laughs> you know, Biden, Biden gets up there with the red lighting. And gets <laughs> right. this on the, I'm like, is this an ad for my book? 